What's up guys, Joyco94 today showing you guys how to completely improve your computer's performance and security um, for free and your speed. Um, it's pretty simple. So, the first thing I'm going to say is if you're a basic computer user, which means you check your Facebook, you check your email, you check YouTube once in a while, you only need two programs. You need CC Cleaner and Super Anti Spyware. I will show you all these programs in detail in a minute. So, yeah, Super Anti Spyware and CC Cleaner. CC Cleaner is to get rid of viruses and Trojans and all that bullshit. CC cleaner is to keep a computer running smoothly, fast, and easily. That's a word. It is a word, but it doesn't make sense there. But whatever, you know what I mean. Um, so yeah, just use that and these two programs. And again, I'll show you how to use these. If you're a person that wants to make sure that they have no viruses on the computer, but doesn't want to have to get a full-time antivirus that you have to pay for, or if you don't want to have to crack a program um, and steal it and everything, then I would suggest Super Anti Spyware, CC Cleaner, and then Malwarebytes as, an, as a secondary opinion. So what I mean is you you scan with CC Cleaner and it finds ten threats or whatever, and then you think okay maybe I still have something. So you scan with Malwarebytes after and it finds two that CC or that Super Anti Spyware missed. That's a great system to use. That works very well, and it's for something that only does like I said Facebook, MySpace, Twitter. And then when uses MySpace, I'm sorry, Facebook, email, um, whatever couple programs you don't really need a full-time antivirus but I would suggest CC cleaner and super anti spyware no matter what kind of computer you user are because those are both extremely extremely highly recommended by me programs I've been using them for years and I've loved them so if you're a person that uses your computer a lot for torrents and possibly porn or video downloading programs and key gens and all that kind of shit and go into a lot of blog sites and Forum sites and stuff like that, where there could be viruses. If you go to hack forums a lot, and the YNC and uh, Pirate Bay, and all these sites that are actually potentially harmful, you're gonna want a full-time antivirus. I suggest um, Bitdefender Total Security 2013, Bitdefender Internet Security 2013, or Bitdefender Antivirus Plus 13, or 2000, or Bitdefender 2012. Any of them work. So any of these Bitdefender programs are great. I use Total Security 2012. I have not updated to 2013 yet. I eventually will do that. But um, yeah. So these are great full-time antiviruses. And I just want to mention, I did make this video. Actually, if it's kind of funny. I made this video last year, August 12th, and today is August 11th. So if I were to wait till tomorrow and make this video, or upload it tomorrow, it would be kind of funny. I might even upload it tomorrow, just because it would be funny like that. But anyways, um, other full-time antivirus programs that are good is Zone Alarm and um, AVG. Those are also two good programs. I just don't like to use them anymore. I never used AVG, but I know it's good. I know a lot of people use it. And Zone Alarm, I used it a long time, but I noticed that it took up a lot of CPU, which slows your computer. But and the reason it takes up CPU, any antivirus that's full-time will take up CPU because it needs it to run all the time and constantly scan and constantly have firewall. It was just doing it overboard, so I got rid of it. So, and switched to Bitdefender. So anyways, yeah, those are two great programs. I'm not saying they're bad anymore. Or not good anymore. So here's CC Cleaner. Um, to use it, you just click Analyze. And then once it's done, it's going to go extremely fast for me because I just did this seconds ago. And then you click Run Cleaner. OK. And then it finishes it. OK, those are removed. Registry Error. You click Scan for Issues. And it's not going to find anything, so I'm just going to cancel it. If it did, you'd click Fix Selected Issues. By the way, click right here if you need to update it. But it'll automatically tell you if there's updates once you uh, download this and everything. It'll, when you open the program again, it'll tell you that there's an update. So once you fix, you click Fix Selected Issues, it'll come up. Do you want to back up these changes to the registry? I always click No. You can click Yes, but I always click No. Um, and then you click Fix All Selected Issues, and then click Close, and you are done. Now, another thing this program can do is you can uninstall programs and everything, and you can disable things from startup, which is good. For example, like um, Uvu. I have Uvu on my computer, and when it first installs, it always wants to start up every time you turn on your computer, which makes it take longer. You just click on it and just click Disable, and then it will not start up every time until you actually click on it. The next program for speed and performance is going to be Astrologic's Boost Speed. Um, when you open it, you click one click scan, it will scan for registry errors, um, disk errors disk defragment and junk files and it'll do all that with one click once you're done as you can see scan options okay register errors junk files disk errors fragmented disks um 
You can also erase browsing history, erase Windows history, clean up temporary files, and optimize memory. System Advisor shows you things like, I'll show you hidden things I hid. I, it wants me to disable um, error reporting services. I don't want to disable them because it's good to have that on. And my registry is defragged fine. It just wants me to, it just says this for some reason. I don't know why. But, um, yeah, other program things it can do is it can clean your disk, defrag, repair. Um, well, you can read the features. This is good if you have um, duplicates. It'll let you find them and read them easily. Um, you can automatically or manually optimize your internet. It works pretty good. So, yeah, that's Astrologic's boost speed. Um, next program is going to be Super Anti-Spyware. Again, I highly recommend this for anyone. Anyone that's going to use the computer for anything, Super Anti-Spyware and CC Cleaner, you're going to want those no matter what because they work fucking awesome. And they're so simple to use. I taught my I taught my 69 year old grandpa how to use these, and he's not very smart with computers. Not to be an asshole, but he's, I mean, he's an older man. You know, they're not going to be technologically tech savvy usually. So cool things with this program is you can manage or you can go to repairs, and it will let you enable your re-enable your desktop background and all these things. You can look at it. So go to home. You're going to want to click update before you do a scan. I already did it 47 minutes ago. So you can do quick scan, complete scan, critical point scan, or custom scan. And as you can see, it does all these things right here. It's about 90% effective, and that's what I said. If you want to make sure you have everything removed, you download Malwarebytes, and you scan with Super Anti-Spyware once a month, right? And then maybe every other month, you scan with Super Malwarebytes too. Or if you just want to scan every time you scan, you scan with Super Anti-Spyware, it's done, it finds whatever, then you scan with Malwarebytes after. doesn't matter. Now, if you're going to use this high boost, I suggest doing that overnight. Um... The first time you scan with this program, if you've never scanned with an antivirus, and even if you have, it ha sometimes it will find a lot more than you would think it's on there. Um, it will take a couple hours sometimes because it finds so much. So I suggest doing this overnight the first time. Same thing with any antivirus. You're going to want to do the first scan you ever do overnight unless you have a lot of time and you don't mind waiting. So just hit start scan. It will scan. Once it's done, you just click next, etc. All right, so the last program is Bitdefender Total Security 2012. Um, the scan, you just click scan now, whatever, and as you can see, there's all these other options, firewall, anti-spam, update, parental control, privacy, safe box, tune up, network map, and safe go. A whole bunch of cool shit in this program. So, that's it guys, I don't want to make this video real long and go on a long time about it. Um, last couple times I tried to make this video, it's been like 15, 16 minutes, and I don't want to make you guys sit there for that long of a video. So, um, yeah, if you need more help with any of these programs, just comment and I'll try to make, and if you want me to, I can make a tutorial how to use any of these programs I just talked about in detail, if you don't get it. But, um, it should all be pretty self-explanatory and pretty easy to use. So, all the links for these programs, downloads, and everything you need to do with these programs will all be in the description. Um, please do me a favor and hit the thumbs up button, and remember to subscribe if you haven't already. By the way, thank you guys, I hit 2,000 subscribers last night. When I get home, back to my actual house on Tuesday... I will be sure as soon as I can make a video of a setup video of my house and show my face like I promised. So, um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Joy Kong 94 out.